If you work late in your shop, like what I do after eight o'clock at night until the wee hours of the morning, sometimes you're going to run into a need for something and you can't just run to the store and get it because they're closed. Recently, I needed to sharpen my plane irons and I needed a ruler for employing the Charles Worth ruler trick on the back of the plane iron. And I couldn't find one around the shop. So I thought there's gotta be something around here I can make it with and I'll show you what I did. Okay, let's talk about the supplies you're gonna need first. You're gonna need some safety glasses, mask, hearing protection, hacksaw, Sharpie marker, tape measure, and uh, you're gonna need some kind of steel to use to make this Charles Worth ruler with. I recently broke a bandsaw blade that was getting dull and there's no sense in getting it welded back together. So that's what I'm gonna use because it's good hard steel. It'll stay flat on any sharpening stone that I use. It doesn't have any etchings on it either. So when you start to rub the plane blade across it, it's not gonna jump up and down in all the little etched grooves. And the other thing is the thickness. This one's 0 0.025 uh, of an inch thick. And I would say you want to use something between about 0 0.02 of an inch and 0 0.03 of an inch. And this is dead center at 0 0.025. I'm going to make two of these and I'm going to make them the same length as my diamond stones. I'm going to make two just because inevitably I'm going to lose one or it's going to get damaged or whatever. I can give one to a friend. We'll just cut this with a hacksaw. Make sure to get something on to protect your lungs while you cut this off. I'm just going to scribe a line along the uh, bottom edge of the gullets just so when I grind the teeth off I'll be able to keep a relatively straight edge on this in the end. Next we'll grind off the teeth. Make sure you got safety glasses on, your mask or respirator, and some hearing protection. Next we'll just remove some of the uh, burrs and the rough edges. So we'll just get some water spritzed on here with some hone right in it so that the tool steel doesn't rust. Work it around a little bit, get the burrs off. This was a super fast, simple project. It took like five or 10 minutes to make a pair of these. Anybody can do it. So go make a couple for yourself.